Other people have a right to know if they are potential objects of your sexual fantasies. You think people have the right to know what other people think of them? This is a very strange thing you've said here. It's none of my business what other people think of me. I mean, it's a pretty basic, solid concept. I mean, unless you think that we should have thought police, and I thought that was something you were against. Do you think we should go around shaming people for their thoughts? Yeah, nobody has the right to know what other people think of them. You can ask people, you can request, but you might not like the answers that you get when people tell you if they're being honest. And so that's why it's not fair to walk around and say, I'm attracted to anyone, anyone at all. No one's safe. Yes, yeah, safe from being considered attractive. Now, whenever a group is, if there's like a group of people sitting in a room with Wayne Brady, and so it's a diverse group, and you've got like a overweight 65-year-old man, and then you got a, you know, a young woman and whatever. Everyone's sitting around, and they're all thinking, he could be attracted to any one of us right now. Oh, no, the horror. Any one of us. It could be any of us. It's scary. It's like some kind of Agatha Christie novel in a weird way. No, you're just a prude. Have a nice day.